Hey guys, I'm back with another GoPro tips and tricks video. In this video, we're gonna be unboxing the Joby GorillaPod Action Tripod with mounts for GoPro. This is part of their action series. What this is, is it's a tripod for your GoPro that has flexible legs that allow it to mount to almost anything. Um, as you can see in the picture here, they're all standing all over these rocks, they're holding onto them and they're getting level shots. On the back, they have some cool photos of the camera being mounted onto trees for biking, which is a very cool idea and something that's not really possible with anything but one of these. And they also talk about the ball head that comes on this tripod. And I'll talk a little bit more about that once we unbox it. So it's got an integrated aluminum ball head and it includes two quick release plates, meaning that it has one base plate that works with any quarter by 20 inch camera and it has another base plate designed specifically for your GoPro. It can also, um, says here that it can hold up to one kilo of um, camera. So definitely a lot more than what your GoPro weighs. I'm gonna go ahead and open it up. So we just start at the top. Let's open, pull the tripod out. You put the packaging aside now. Except I think there's a manual in here. There we go. All right. So we get a little manual and this explains to us how to mount our camera onto the base plate, and then how to install the base plate onto the tripod. Um, so this is the tripod itself. We can pull it out. And as you can see, these legs are totally flexible and I can put them into any position I want and then they'll just stay there. So what this means, if I wanted to wrap around a tree, I would go up to the tree and I'd wrap the legs around it just like this and then I could just leave it and it would stay there. Um, if you want to mount, if you want to use this onto uneven surfaces, you can put some legs higher than others like this and then, um, yeah, you get your level shot. One thing that's really cool with this one and makes this kind of tripod stand out from some of the other ones that Joey makes is the ball head. So what this means is that you can basically set the camera up or the tripod up into any position, any angle you want. Uh, maybe it's hanging off something so it's sideways or anything like that, and then you just unscrew the ball head lock screw here, and then adjust it until your shot's level, and then tighten it back up. So this totally allows you to um, first worry about making sure the legs get a secure hold on whatever um, you're mounting to, and then second, it um, once you've got the secure thing, you can then worry about getting the shot level. With some of these other tripods like this, you're gonna to have to do both at the same time and you're gonna to have to sacrifice one or the other. You're either gonna have a very secure uh, connection with the legs or your camera's gonna be level. So now we'll look at the two base plates that come with the, the mount. We've got the quarter by 20 inch um, camera mount, which comes pre-installed. And then they also give us a custom GoPro base plate. This is also, however, a GoPro tripod adapter because as you can see on the bottom of it, there's a mount for a tripod screw. So if I wanted to just screw this onto here, like this, I could do that. But there's a way cooler, cleaner way to do this than that. What you do is you push the button at the front of the uh, base plate here, and then slide the base plate out. So that's completely removable. And then you can take the new one and just slide it in and it'll just snap into place. So take that out just like that. And now let's throw our camera on here. We'll take our camera, pop this on here, slide the bolt through. And then once our camera's mounted, we can just slide this onto the base plate. And then we can use the ball head to get it into whatever position we want. So guys, I feel that things like this open up a lot of um, versatility in mounting options. Uh, places that I see myself using this are mounting for time lapses. I'm probably gonna be using this a lot uh, just because it's easy and it's very small and light, so I don't have to haul around a big tripod, but because of its versatility and ability to hang on to things, if I wanna get a high up shot of something, I can just strap this on to whatever that thing or something that's tall. Uh, very secure um, and I really do like the ball head option. One of these without the ball head option to me isn't uh, nearly as valuable as a, as a tool for filming at, than this as this is. 
the fact that it has two base plates is pretty cool. You want to use another camera with it, you can. Like I said, it has up to one kilogram of um, capacity, so you can mount a fairly large camera onto it uh, instead of your GoPro. So guys, thanks for watching. This is another GoPro tips and tricks video. If you've enjoyed it, please make sure you subscribe. Check out my channel for lots more videos. And if you could, like the video. Of course, if you didn't like it, well then don't like it. Um, if you've got any questions or comments, leave them below. And I will read them and I will get back to you. Uh, one of the questions for this video would be, how do you see yourself using one of these? Or do you see yourself using one of these? Or is this something that you are just completely um, not interested in and would never use your GoPro? You want to mount it on yourself. You want to use the chesty or the head strap mount and that's it. And you don't want to take the camera off of you to get uh, different kinds of shots. Let me know. Uh, but guys, until next time, thanks a lot for watching.